Hey guys, welcome back to another very interesting video of our channel Versatile Knowledge. Uh, today I'll be explaining you guys what is the IP rating in smartphones. Uh, you guys might have seen uh, the gadgets or the smartphones will have that IP ratings like IP67 or IP68 and you people might be having doubts of what is IP rating and in this video I'll be clearing all your doubts related to waterproofing and dust proofing of smartphones. Let's get started. The first point is the term IP stands for ingress protection or international protection. Who gives this international protection or ingress protection? This ingress protection or international protection is governed by an international body. It is given for all the electronic equipments. It is given for street lights. It is given for smartphones. It is given for tablets. It is given for computers and it is given for almost all electronic devices that is present in the world. This is a very old standard that has been in existence from a very long time. The next thing when it comes to the IP is the numbers. The numbers that is present in the IP rating will be 67 or 68 but the very important thing that we need to know is we should not pronounce the numbers as 67 or 68 because the number 6 denotes something else and number 8 denotes something else the two terms have to be pronounced as 67 or 68 by separating the two letters so what does the first number means and what does the second number means the first number means the protection of the devices against the dust and dirt or any solids the second number means the protection of the devices against the liquids the second number denotes how devices is resistant towards the liquids the first number is for the dust resistance or the dust proofing the second number is for the waterproofing or the water resistance first i will explain what the dust proofing rating means the number zero in the dust proofing means it doesn't have any uh, protection or any proofing or any resistance against any solids that is present in the world the number six means it is resistant towards the dust or dirt or you can even say that it is dust or dirt proof it doesn't affect the general component or general functioning of your smartphones so number six means it is completely resistant towards the dust or dirt let's talk about the second digit that is the protection for the devices against the liquids the number zero in the second digit means it is not resistant towards any type of liquids the number seven and number eight in the second digit means the immersion capacity of any device in the water the second digit is to denote the protection of the devices against the liquids or water number zero means there is no protection against any sort of liquids that will fall on your gadgets number seven means you can immerse your gadgets or devices inside the water for one to one and a half meters for 30 minutes number eight means you can immerse your devices or gadgets inside the water for three and a half to four meters for up to 30 minutes now we got to know what is the first digit and what is the second digit the first digit denotes the protection of devices against the dust and dirt the second digit means the protection of devices against any liquids the next question is why some devices have ip rating and why some devices does not have ip rating for example uh, the samsung galaxy s9 or the samsung galaxy note 9 or uh, the lg v40 or uh, lg g7 or any uh, other top line uh, uh, flagship phones have this ip rating but the phones such as uh, the xiaomi or the phones such as uh, the oneplus 6 or oneplus 60 do not have ip rating what is the reason behind this the main reason behind this is the smartphone companies should be paying certain amount of money to the international body to get their phones tested for the dust and the water and then get the IP ratings. That's why certain smartphone manufacturers in order to make sure that their devices will be priced less in the market do not get this IP certification or IP standard rating to their smartphones. Just for an example OnePlus 6 or OnePlus 60 was priced around 35-36,000. In order to get the IP ratings the company OnePlus should be paying some amount of money for that international body which will test these smartphones for IP rating they should be paying some amount of money for that for the test that they will be conducting and then they will get the certification then they, that certification they can use in all the smartphones that our phone is IP68 or IP67 rated if OnePlus does this process the price of every smartphone will get increased that's why the OnePlus have not got their phones IP rated that doesn't mean uh, OnePlus smartphones is not resistant towards normal splashes against water or dust or dirt. They will be uh, up to some extent they will be protected against the dust and dirt but just that they do not have that IP rating. Another question is if even if the devices have IP rating or uh, if the devices such as Galaxy S9 or Note 9 or an iPhone XS have an IP rating is it is it protected against all kinds of water or all kinds of dust and dirt in the world? The simple answer to this question is no. All this test that is 
done by the IP standard body is done in laboratory tested conditions. So the laboratory tested conditions and real life conditions will be completely different. The IP68 or IP67 ratings will be given for laboratory tested conditions. So in real life, it's better if you keep your phone free from any sort of liquids or any sort of water. What happens if my if I dip my phone inside the water for four meters? What happens if I dip my phone in the water for more than 30 seconds? It all depends on the kind of water that you're dropping your phone in. It all depends on the type of your smartphone. It all depends on the manufacturer. You people might find this funny, but the truth is it all depends on the luck of the smartphone or the gadget user. Some devices which has IP rating might get affected with water or uh, any kind of liquid instantly. But some devices which do not have an IP rating might not get affected with water. I also have another example where OnePlus 6 smartphone which do not have any protection against the IP rating dipped inside a swimming pool. Nothing got affected. Everything everything to date is functioning properly. So this is the best example. The IP ratings that is present on any gadget depends on the luck of the smartphone user. There is no smartphone in the world that is kismet proof. If you guys have liked this video, please hit the like button share this video with your friends and subscribe to our channel for more interesting content ahead. Thank you for watching guys.